Hey y'all, cooking, cutting up, keeping it real. I hadn't quite figured out the balance of this, you know, holder thing. So, sorry for the view, but I wanted to show you what I was doing. Um, this is hash brown casserole that I've made up for years, but today I'm gonna put it in my crock pot. I saw something on Pinterest and I thought, you know, you can do that ahead of time and leave it. So, what I've done is I've used a whole bag of hash brown potatoes and I like the uh, shredded ones. I sprayed my um, crock pot with cooking spray and I have put um, about a tablespoon of bone sucking sauce, about two teaspoons of, there we go, garlic salt. And my guys don't like like onions, so I used about a teaspoon of onion powder. And over that I have put one can of a cream of chicken soup. So I'm gonna stir that in and I'm gonna add eight ounces of sour cream. And I'm gonna turn this baby on low. I also put in one stick of melted butter. And I put half of the butter on the bottom, then the hash browns, then the, the butter over the top, just because I thought it would mix in better. But anyway, um, so I'm gonna put in half of this sour cream. This is 16 ounce, so I'm gonna only use eight ounces. And the recipe, <clears throat> that I read this morning was called cheesy potatoes or something like that and I'll post that um, my hash brown recipe calls for it to be in a casserole dish and put in the oven which it's really good like that too so you can do the exact same thing and put it in your oven but I top mine in the oven with crushed Ritz crackers um, and then a little bit of spray butter over the top just so they don't burn but anyway this is how we're gonna do it today just to see how it turns out and then I'm gonna add in, I cheated today, because I'm tired, just so you know. Um, I'm gonna add in uh, two cups of this, let's see, two cups of sharp, sharp shredded cheddar cheese. This is 16 ounces, so two cups. Okay, I'm gonna mix that in. I'm gonna cut this on low for four hours, and I'll show you a picture of the finished product. Um, earlier today, I put a um, pretty big uh, pork shoulder in uh, the crock pot, the other crock pot. I sprayed it, put the pork shoulder in. I put um, Montreal steak seasoning, heavy, and a little bit of garlic salt, and a little bit of that butt, butt, bone sucking sauce uh, on the outside of it. And then I put one bottle of beer over the top and that's been cooking on low for about two hours it'll need to cook at least six maybe eight um, so I'm gonna put this on low and cook it for four hours and then I'm gonna turn the heat off of it and it'll be ready for dinner so that's what I'm doing today cooking cutting up keeping it real I'll show you the finished product make it a great one oh.